check how much oil. Hi guys, welcome back to a new video. Today I'm off to J2 Auto. I'm gonna have a breather fit on the Mark II. I'm trying to get a breather in the head so that we can reduce the blow by the crankcase. So I bought the breather from the 1.6 Mark IV. That's the basically an extension of the oil filler cap that becomes a breather but we have an issue because it's too tall so it's actually touching the bonnet uh, my friend Andrew is going to help me make some sort of ghetto hack and cut it up and try and get it to work and hopefully it will reduce blow by so let's see what happens <laughs> So this is the adapter, as you can see it's actually much bigger, we cut it down, when I say we I mean Andrew, cut it down and we shortened it and it fits the bonnet clears and now it's to figure out the hose situation so I'm going to run the hose from here to there. Um, I've got a few different fittings and connections, this is not ideal, I don't have the right hose because this. It's 28 more and I don't want to run a 28 more hose through there, it's just too big. So I want to do like a, a step up or a step a step down or something of the sorts. Um, let's see if this, this will work. So I'm at J2 Auto. I didn't show you guys earlier but this is the spot, this is where I had the car dynoed about two weeks ago. Saudi is currently getting a forged rebuild. <clears throat> yeah, no engine in there. Okay, so the hose is now connected. Don't ask how or what we did. I will not speak of the ghetto methods we have used. Um, but yeah, so now we're just gonna cut, cut the hose and plug it. And then I'll get to test it and see if it breathes less. Would you look at that work of art? Success? Success. <laughs> the ghetto mod has been made. I mean, it's, it's not terrible. Let's, let's see if it works. Okay, so we're going for a spin. Check if this breather mod is worth all the time and effort. It's completely legit. <laughs> Trust me, this is going to work. It's going to work We need to make these lights do something. Yeah, that'll be good. It only seems appropriate. Well, there's many things that need to do something in this car that don't. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> now that you're patient. <laughs>
Yo, I really hope that this Pisa mod makes some difference. Oh, then we're going back. Okay, let's let's get some some distance between us. It's not much road though. Well, not this section. Um, where you've been stuck in? Yeah. Just after that, then you open up over there.
meat check. How much oil? Not much. Oh yeah, that's quite a bit over there. Um, <laughs> please explain. <laughs> Okay, so not much in the breather, but there's a, a crime scene over there. Oh, it's not too bad. So we just created a silicone seal under this cap here, just to keep the oil from pushing out from there. I would um, not recommend, but I'm going to try it out and see how it goes. I hope it works. Just put the silicone. I'm driving the car back. I'm just cruising it. I don't want to push the basically push the oil up through the breather so that it can just fully dry and cure. And then I will take it for another drive and hopefully it doesn't spill the guts of the oil all over the bonnet again. That was quite quite interesting. But like these seals, these I bought this cap from Goldbachen and those seals are not the greatest so i guess i should have expected something like that so guys that's it for this video thanks so much for watching hope you enjoyed it i would not recommend that breather mod 